I'm going to demonstrate a little old consumer VCR head cleaning tape. I'm not advising people to use these. I know there's better ways to clean your heads. Safer, less destructive to the heads. I'm just uh, demonstrating this as a vintage curiosity. There's another type of these where you put a few drops of alcohol into a little hole in the cassette. So we're going to use this on the uh, Panasonic TV1100 here. And uh, we're watching it on the uh, Sony Trinitron. This is your first cleaning. Your video and audio heads will now be cleaned. This is a mono audio test. Stereo audio test, right channel. Stereo audio test, left channel. Your video and audio heads are now clean. Press stop and eject tape now. Do not rewind. All right, we're going to test a couple tubes this morning with the Fedtro Jiffy tester. And also test fuses. See inside it. Well, that's a pretty complicated and expensive piece of equipment. Who needs a fancy tube tester when you have something like this? Alright, that one lights up pretty good. Mm, kind of dim there. Let me turn this light off. Not bad. Let's try the 12SA7. Alright, not bad. At the film, 3 hours, 30 minutes. Coordinated Universal Time. National Institute of Standards and Technology Time. This is radio station WWB, Fort Collins, Colorado. Broadcasting on internationally allocated standard carrier frequencies of 2.5, 5, 10, 15, and 20 megahertz. Providing time of day, standard time interval, and other related information. Inquiries regarding these transmissions may be directed to the National Institute of Standards and Technology. Radio station WWV, 2000 East, 58, Fort Collins, Colorado, 805 2 4. Alright, we're on grams. Two and a half grams for a penny, that's right. Let's see what the SLD2 is tracking at. 1.9 grams, 2 grams, I'd say that's right, or close enough. So I got this little Electro brand radio from Goodwill. Comes in its own little clear plastic pouch. Uh, has a little earphone with it. Made in Hong Kong. Of course, I don't get anything on AM really, so. It's odd that I can buy expensive radios that don't work. And this is a probably mid 60s cheap brand, and it worked right out of the box. Hard to understand that. An electro brand. <laughs>